Hello, welcome to our poster, Connecting People, Connecting Support, Occupation Matters. My name is Claire Craig and I'm speaking on behalf of a wonderful team, including myself, Helen Fisher, Elaine Hunter, Alison McKean and Ashley Gray. Our poster describes just one of the innovations we've developed in response to the COVID-19 pandemic with a focus on enabling people um, living with dementia to continue to connect to meaningful occupations in the home and in the community. COVID-19 has had a devastating effect on everyone, but more so on the lives of people living with dementia. The research particularly shows that people living with dementia as a consequence of social isolation and lack of access to services and resources has meant that one in three individuals have reported a loss in confidence in carrying out daily activities and um, a significant increase in cognitive decline. As a group of researchers, policy makers, clinicians, we're all passionate about occupation. We wanted to find a way to create something to enable people to connect with things that they found meaningful. And in order to do that, to build the skills, techniques, understanding, to maintain participation in valued activities and occupation. We created a, a web platform named Connecting People, Connecting Support Online. From the beginning of the pandemic, we posted two activities a week, one relating to occupational functioning and a series of activities focusing on creative or leisure pursuits. We made a really simple to navigate web platform with an element of chat, things that people could share with family or friends a section which is all around things that people could try and then links to more more resources that people could explore um, and then a little kind of play often featuring things around memory or word search for cognitive stimulation. What was really lovely was that people with dementia, occupational therapists, artists, poets, students all contributed to ideas of activities and the creation of content. It became a real hub of sharing and a community of practice in itself. The work has been promoted through a significant um, social media presence and campaign. As a consequence of that, up to date, about 65,000 people have accessed the materials and it's fed into kind of a huge range of initiatives of people taking out the materials on visits to family and um, the work that Alzheimer's Scotland are doing. So the feedback that we've had from people has been absolutely extraordinary and people with dementia have described it as a lifeline and as a way of continuing to keep well. And through this whole process, thinking about what that might mean for services moving forwards in the future and, and how this kind of hybrid of uh, technology Based support and face-to-face -face support to promote occupation could create an, another dimension to that and to maximise the reach of what we do. Thank you very much for listening. Look forward to hearing your thoughts and comments.